Hello everyone, Darkai3 here again with another episode of Let's Play Deus Ex Human Evolution. In the last episode we found out about Event Jensen's past and today we are probably going to continue on and find out a little bit more. So, I think today we're looking for this Michelle character. We've also got to find Fedorova, I think he was called, and kick his ass as well. So, let's head over this way and get this stuff going. This way, open door, thank you. Uh, do I actually, actually, as a quick thought, because I do these in recording stints, do I have any, oh I have three practice points, okay. Um, see, see what I do again. That'd just be hilarious to do a assault rifle, you know. Uh, if I get the last energy cell, then I can do augmentation stuff out the wazoo. Uh, stealth enhancer. That's pretty cool. Uh, I don't even need to worry about those. I'm fine with sneaking around, sneaky sneaky. Smart vision, see through walls. Track threats through walls, okay. Ah. Let's get that, because that'll come in handy. Um, I would like to get the speed through walls, but for now I'll have to make do. And should we get run faster? Should we get run further? Let's get run faster. There we go, right. There we go, we got better speed now. Oh. You're not. The thing to do is get outside the downtown area and catch a tram there. But it's dangerous out there. The rioters are breaking windows and looting. I can break next. I'll break next. I like breaking next. I'll try to find out for you. Yeah, find out. Get on the radio then. Oh, we've arrested the dancers. Uh, hello. The city's hello, woman. Flames because everyone believes some news story. Hello, dancers. Take a walk, buddy. Or kick your but face I, in. I don't know, and I don't want to know what's going on. Hello, this sir. This is not a good time to talk to anyone from DPD, sir. Detroit Police Department sucks ass. Yeah, I said that. You can come for it. Right. This is the fight again, isn't it? So, yeah. What's up, homies? I thought the police overreacted. Yeah. As soon as that one guy got the clock, the cops oh. broke their perimeter and charged in. Why didn't they just send a couple of guys to the What are you taking photos of? You're taking photos of. Worse. What? What, what? What? How are you taking photos? You're not even got. A, oh, I'm not even gonna ask. Hello, officers. Can I jump on this? See if I can get some good view of what's going on here. That's loud. Hold on. There we go. The, there we go. Yes. Oh wow! There actually is stuff going on over there. Ah! Ah! Oh, so close. Let's see if I can actually get over there. Take a look. Nah, I can't get over there. They've specifically made it so I can. Got very close though. Very close. Right, where am I going? Into the apartment. Got ya. Ah, cool. Never realised that was there. Not that I needed to use it at any point, but okay. Ha! Oh, hello people. We're gonna shoot some hoops. We're gonna shoot some people. Probably people. How am I getting up there? Am I getting through up this way? Seems legit. Up we go. Stop whistling. This is a whistle free zone. Or kick your face off. For whistling. Yeah, I went now. Uh, I just realised I forgot to set my timer again. Bugger. Oh, there's a ladder here. Cool. Let's see. Actually, while I'm at the top here, let's set my timer. Been going for a few minutes now, haven't I? So, uh, timer. Uh, I've been going for a few minutes, so there we go. Cool. Let's continue on the journey then. Forgot up here. Anybody fearing for their life will be shot, and then if those who survive will be shot again. I'll keep shooting you until you all die, basically. Right. Ha! Oh! Ha ha! No. Uh, what weapon do I have the most ammo with? 
obviously that one, but let's, use, let's put that on the, uh, oh, put you away just in case. Right. Let's go. Cool, ha! Okay, we're cool, we're safe. Anyone here? We safe? Let's go. Shut the door. Hello, Michelle. Uh, before I talk to you, let's make sure no one can interrupt me. There we go. With my refrigerator of protection and my gun of justice, I shall make sure that no one shall escape. Mm, nice bedroom you got in here. Very nice modern bed. And nice armchair. I like the armchair. In your bathroom. See, if you just had a person walk into your house, suddenly you you wouldn't just sit there and not say anything, would you? You'd say, stop. Where are you going? Stop going into my bathroom and bedroom. Hello, madam. Did I leave my door open? Wait. You're not from Rolling Mills. You're too handsome to be from Rolling Mills. No, I'm from Death no, on Wheels. No, not. Mrs. Michelle Walters, is it? My name's Adam Jensen. I never had no, no. You much too old to be him. You must be from Rolling Mills. And please, it's Miss Walters. Brent Radford sent me. Do you remember him? He's a detective. Yeah. Oh, she's Love stopping, hasn't she? To me. He still has my photos of Adam when he was a baby. <laughs> Could you be a dear and fetch them for me? I forgot who has them, though. We got them. Let's get the photos. Are those the photographs? Oh, yes, yes. Thank you. I, I haven't seen Adam Jensen in such a long time. Forever, mm. it seems. Such a happy baby. Let's ask Krasta. Miss Walters, can you tell me about the boy in those photos? The boy in those photos? Adam. Tragic, really, what happened to his parents. His oh. real parents. Maybe she should pay attention to who she's speaking to. They died in that fire. Horrible, really. I was there. At least those other cribs were empty. I only had to save Adam. Mrs. Walters, I really oh, it doesn't need affect you to long focus. Term, does it affect short term? What are you talking about? Why, I already told that nice detective all this already. About the experiments. And the fire at White Helix Labs. Experiment? We knew Adam was special. That's why his parents started the fire. So they didn't do the same thing to the next batch of babies. Ah. So my... Adam's real parents were trying to protect him. But from what? what? Sarif Industries. From the conspiracy, of course. Oh. But I've said too much. Would you be a dear now and go fetch my dinner? Miss Walters, please. I know it was a while ago, and remembering all the details might be hard. But do you think you can try and focus for a minute? What did you tell the detective? Well, Mr. Radford and I spoke about many, many things. But don't you have meals to deliver? And where is my dinner? <sighs> Miss Walters, please. I know it was a while ago. Well... Damn it, she's a Thank you for your time, Miss Walters. Oh, before I forget. Uh oh. If you see Adam, could you please give him this? It's for all the birthdays and Christmases I've missed. I've been saving them. I'll make sure he gets it. Thank you, dear. Right. Why? Twelve or thirteen? Must be twelve or thirteen by now. Make sure he gets something nice. That's about half the age. Uh, let Miss Wolfers rest, okay? Let's just put the fridge back, just in case. Damn it! How do I take it out and can't put it back in? Uh, there we go. Nope, nope. Go on, in you go. That'll do. Anyone sees that? Red? I'm trying to figure out what's going Richard. on. I oh, need you to assign a temporary security detail to an apartment on Brooklyn Court until I can figure out a more permanent solution. The woman's name is Walters. Michelle Walters. Security detail? What the hell, Jensen? Who is this woman? She's... family. Vulnerable. 
But she's vulnerable. I'll explain yeah. later. Just do this for me, please. And not a word to Seraph. Can I trust you on this, Pritchard? Christ, Jensen. Got your back. All right, all right. I'll do it. But there better be a damn good reason for this. That's there always is. a damn good reason for everything I'll tell I do. You next time I see you. But right now I need to get back to work. And Pritchard. Was just, nah. Thanks. Yeah, yeah. Oh. Okay, cool. Achievement unlocked. Acquaintance forgotten. I thought the game froze for a second. Go. Access granted. Sexy. What's in here? Hey B, so you finally moved in, huh? Have I broke any of your stuff? Just let me know when they hook up your internet. I'll come over and give you a hand with everything. Take care, you big bro. And surely if you send them an email, they'll know when... Oh, don't worry. No, I'm not even going to bother asking about that. Right. Oh, hello. Credit chip. 43 credits. What is this? I feel cheated. Don't break into someone's apartment for very little. Uh, this way. Oh, I love having extra sprint. I wish I could triple the amount of sprint I had though. It's down here. It's a door. What's behind this door? Right. Oh, I know where we are. Okay, so is that the only side mission we had to do? Are there no more? Uh, media log. Mission. Nope. Cool, let's find Yanis Sandoval. Hua! I'm Batman! Hello? Right. Let's go see Sandoval and kick his teeth off. Kick his teeth off. Teeth in. You know what I mean? Not one or the other. Right. You may notice a slight, there's a slight sound quality difference between this and my recent videos. That's probably because my computer, my new computer, had a motherboard issue. And I've had to take it apart, and I'm back to using my crap top. It's annoying as all hell. Hello, robot. Uh. Hello. Um. Didn't mean to jump on you. Uh. I'll just uh, casually walk. But no, no, I'm, I'm fine. Sorry. No, 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 no. My bad, honestly. Uh. Yep. 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 How much money am I carrying? Ah, uh, enough money. There's always enough money there. Good evening, robot officer. Say? The button, there's some buttons, that's a reflective thing. I don't know. Right. William Taggart, no better than myth of human augmentation. Good evening, officer. Evening, other officers. Okay. Here's where the stuff gets real. Do this. Bless you. Be under control in the convention center. In Taggart? He's on stage now. His protection is deep. Only those with VIP passes can get by the guards. We'll just stay here. And make sure none of those hooligans try to sneak in the back door. Honest. Right. Entrance. We are in the convention center. Let's let's, let's, let's thing go crazy. Now we can't get in without a VIP pass. So we're gonna find one. And I'm gonna take a drink while I'm waiting. Mmm. Damn, I don't have any chocolate left. I have cookies, but cookies aren't the best thing to eat while doing a video. Because all you hear is crunch, 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 crunch. Crunch, 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 crunch. Yep. Random overloading stuff. Over the load. Oh, I hate loading screens. There we go. Right. So we're in the Detroit Convention Center. We got here augmentation stuff. That's a pretty cool, you know, uh, logo thing. Uh, what have we got around? Anything behind here? Nope. All right. I want to go up there. Do I want to go main hall or meeting hall? It's the third time this escalator has broken down this week. You think they would actually work? Oh. Tell me about it. Now with all the damage out there, I doubt we're gonna see any increase in funding it. Probably not. What are you looking at, copper? Anything questionable here? There's a pen. Oh my god, that pen may do something to you. Lord, I know these pens are dangerous. This is Hello, the end of your kind, Ark. This ride will force the UN to adopt regulations. Um, do you want me to hit you? Because, you know, I've got, I'm an orc, I can... Ah! 
hell was that? What, what happened there? Is it because I'm going the wrong way? Or is it because something's hacking me? Or trying to hack me? Bill is really changing the world for the better. No, he's changing not. It back to what he used to be. He's an asshole. A very big one. just heard William Taggart speak, and isn't he a huh? smooth talker? He doesn't want you to better yourselves. He wants to limit you. He wants the government to have jurisdiction over your body. Oh. You want to get augmented? Oh, no. I'm sorry, but we're not going to let you. You're not going to let me? Ah. Yeah, I like her argument. Hello, sir. Can get close and talk to Mr. Taggart? I will kick the ass of any security guy who gets in my way. Upstairs? Now those doors aren't usable anyway. Uh, what if I go the other way up the other set of stairs? Because I'm pretty sure this is the way I'm meant to go. So as we all know, I'll go the wrong way first. Uh, right. Nope. That fire extinguisher should make him in handy. I don't think it's one picking up a fire extinguisher as an actual just a fire extinguisher in your inventory. Right. What's going on in here? Nothing really amazing. Nope. Hello, officer. Oh. I didn't even need to do that anyway. Okay. Water? Yeah, wasting water. Yeah, that's how I roll. Do they stop? Right. Meeting hall, bathroom, main hall. Uh, I think that's the way I meant to go because I haven't found anything to pick up as yet. Um, okay. Let's go. Well, who are you? Oh. Ah, so she got saved by an augment. augment. Let's walk in. I'm badass. Yeah, backstage area is completely blocked off. Even the janitor can't get back there now. What about the air vents? You're kidding, right? Have you seen the size of those vents? You expect a contortionist or midget is going to try to assassinate Tiger? Let's do it. I'm a contortionist midget. Watch it, sir. There are guards everywhere. Any attempt on Mr. Taggart will be met with deadly force. Well, that's Taggart in that. Right. The camera. <coughs> An officer. Oh. Shouldn't be here, sir. I should. Damn. I can't even argue. Into the ladies' loo. Hello, Evan. Right. Where am I? The gent. This is the gent. Okay. Uh, I can try going through the front door, actually. Oh, this is the women. What? Wait, what? 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 Oh, is this unisex? This is the gent. Oh, it's the gents. Oh, okay. Cool. Well, alarms going there. Got ya. Okay. Let's just go through this door. See what happens. Here we go, cutscene. Cut the evolution is a fantasy, but that is exactly what I am telling you. As a world, where's your sidekick, Taggart? Six months ago, Seraph Industries was attacked by mercenaries whose objective was to cripple our research. But I've learned the attack was just a smokescreen. Megan Reed's team was kidnapped, and Isaiah Sandoval, your personal aide, was involved. <laughs> that is ridiculous. Ladies and gentlemen, I apologize for Mr. Jensen's intrusion, and I assure you that these accusations are without basis. Are they? This is Sandoval. Why are you calling me here? There's been a change of plans. Seraph's team must not make it to the hearing. But that's too soon. If you want me to remove the GPLs, I'll need a full operating suite. Does the facility have one? That's your man, Taggart. Talking about removing implanted GPL devices so that the people who took Seraph scientists could cover it up. I see what's going on here. 
Sarif Industries has received two black eyes in the last few days. The first due to the shocking news coming out of Montreal that biotech companies are secretly participating in unethical super soldier experiments. And the second as a result of their violent escalation of today's peaceful protest. David Sarif and his corporate bedfellows are desperate and in imminent danger of losing the regulation vote, so this man has been sent here to attack my reputation. I'm right here, Taggart. Look at me. I admit, I wouldn't feel bad if your reputation was damaged in front of the press, since you've been doing the same to my colleagues for years. But that's not why I'm here. Sarif scientists are alive, and it's time for the truth to come out. The truth, Mr. Jensen, is that this recording of yours proves nothing. It could have been made by anyone in the world with a grudge against humanity front, and you are our prime suspect. Right, let's get, let's get debating. This credit. Uh... You're right, it's not enough go. to get a conviction. But it's enough for a search warrant. It's all I want, Taggart. Why are you standing in the way? I'm not. I'm trying to protect... Look... Who are you trying Mr. to protect? Jensen. Yourself? Yeah. Bitch. I know why you came here instead of taking your recording to the police. I know the real reason for your accusations, and you're not entirely to blame for what you're doing. It is common. After trauma, such as the one you suffered, to fixate on the event, so to stay bad. blocked in the past. In a word, you're obsessed. Who are you calling obsessed? Uh... Should have act. I can worry about myself later. What's really important now is the five innocent people whose lives were stolen from them during that attack. Sandoval knows where they are. Now, oh, I want you this one. I, I don't want to see anyone's lives stolen from them. They've already been stolen. If you could see your situation clearly, you would realize you're being driven by your losses. Your actions are motivated by an attempt to regain a sense of control at my expense. Stop reading the auto cue. You're turning me into your enemy when I'm not. Ha. <sighs> Uh, uh, let's try of course one. I want control. Every time I touch something, I wonder, just for a second, every time, if what I'm feeling is real. Yeah. It's a bit like being in charge of an organization, I bet. Do you always know what the people of Humanity Front, your people, are doing? Yeah, do you? Of course not. Well, that is to say, I don't need to. Do you? When I founded Humanity Front, I dedicated the organization to the memory of my wife Marjorie, who died okay. trying to help a man addicted to augmentation surgery come to terms with his illness. Marjorie refused to resort to violence. So why would any member of this group do otherwise? We are simply not those kind of people. I wish Stay I could back. make you see that, but I fear you are unable to comprehend non-violent solutions. Please say there's a punch him option. Uh... Let's try this one. I know about your wife's murder, Mr. Taggart. And how it led you to start Humanity Front. I've lost someone close to me too, but I have a chance to get her back. If Sandoval is involved in Megan's abduction in any way, he dishonored your wife's memory. For her sake, and for the sake of my people, I need to know where he is. All right, Mr. Jensen. You're right. For Marjorie's sake, I can't risk tainting the integrity of what I built in her name. I'll help you find Isaiah, and I pray that you are wrong about him. As do I. I hope I'm wrong. Ladies and gentlemen, I apologize, but I'm going to have to beg your indulgence for a few moments more. If you will all please remain patient. I will return as soon as I can. Thank you. Mr. Jensen, I'll see you backstage. Yeah, booyah!
convincing. I'm a very convincing individual. Like his moustache. His moustache convinces people to shut up. Achievement. There we go. Yeah. Look at that. Cool. Okay. Right, I'm going to stop here then. So thanks for watching, guys. Hopefully you enjoyed it. Um, and hopefully I'll see you in the next episode of Desert Human Evolution. See you later, guys.